But how do you kind of manage that with, with your guys? Coach, you were talking about moving guys around, I guess. Is that what your plan is to kind of manage that situation? Absolutely. And we teach conceptually, so all the guys know all the positions, and uh, it shouldn't be a hard transition for anybody. Just what would it mean for, in terms of the momentum to end the season with a win rather than ending in a, in a, in a skid? Like well, we always want to win. Uh, that, that's the goal. So uh, I don't know if it's as much as ending the season as it is just winning this ball game, you know, and, and obviously sending the seniors out on a high note uh, and, and having some momentum going into the offseason. Last week you guys didn't go deep much and didn't look to go deep much. I know that was partly because of the win and the running game looked good, but do you feel like you guys might, you know, look for some more deep balls against a young Kentucky secondary? Sure, if they're there, we're going to take them. So was that last week more of a function that Vandy wasn't giving you a deep ball? Uh, I, I, it, couple things that is one of them uh, they, they tend to play a little softer uh, but also like you said we, we were having success running the ball one to keep doing that. Mike when, when a quarterback throws too early interception does that change anything in your mind saying well maybe we can't do this moving forward I guess how do you how do you manage that situation when you get throws too early interceptions yeah um, are you talking about when Jason's Josh Jason's uh, curl route is that the one I'm not sure exactly the, yeah well yeah when he on yeah. the, the right it, side it's line, just yeah. a timing issue, and we work on things. Marquez going out after that first series, does that affect play calling at all? Or are you, you still have the same game plan, nothing changes? Uh, sure. We, we always think players, not plays, and, and he being one of our playmakers, uh, that does affect play calling a bit, but you, you adjust and uh, you, you, know, you accentuate other guys. I guess have you continued working on that adjustment with him being out the past two days? Sure. You know, again, Jason Kroon brings a lot to the table. Alton Howard brings a lot to the table. Uh, and obviously, Josh Smith uh, continues to develop. So uh, there's options there. The offensive Brandon line is, you guys have to go to, to Stocksdale as that second tight end. I think maybe did it the first series and not much else after that. Is, is that still something you like to do as a two tight end or is, are you limited because of the personnel situation? No, I mean, it, it's, again, trying to play to the strengths of our personnel and also trying to um, find the best matchups. And uh, it, it was something that we just felt uh, again, wasn't, wasn't uh, conducive to us uh, doing what we wanted to do. How has Josh responded this week? I mean, how, what, what do you see from the practice? Pretty much the same guy or has this comp any difference in his confidence? Josh is a long? competitor and he, he comes to work every day. So he, you know, we have a snap and clear mentality, and, and uh, we're putting that game behind us and moving on to the next one. The offensive line has kind of taken a lot of heat this year, but you know, here you are, Bray Johns, ten yards away from a thousand-yard season. How do you think they've done this year? Our offensive line is is uh, right now still the strength of our offense, and those guys, it's a veteran group, and uh, they've done a good job leading. And um, you know, I'm, I'm obviously grateful to the leadership they've provided. Uh, we we want to go out and make sure that we win this game for them. Do you worry about a young quarterback trying to overcompensate? I mean, he threw for 50 yards last week. Do you worry about him trying to trying to do too much Saturday to kind of make up for a struggle in the past couple? Of weeks? No, he, he's a level-headed guy. He knows he's just got to manage the game and play within the game plan.